Hello, it is Teenage DC Fan back with another video, and in today's video, I'll be reviewing the latest episode of The Flash, titled "The F The Girl with the Red Lightning." Um, that's obviously re referring to Nora, because in the last episode, when she tapped into Thon's like negative speed force, she got red lightning, and yeah. So, basically, in this episode, uh, there were two main storylines, I think. Uh, I'll go over the first one to start. Um, so, Star Labs is giving out the MetaHuman Cure at CCPD. So, a bunch of MetaHumans are there, and they w all want the cure. And Captain Singh had to go do something, so he left Joe in charge. And he was getting overwhelmed with the whole thing, because, like, people are getting in fights, everybody's impatient, everybody's asking him questions, and he just doesn't know what to do. So then, he just says that he needs a minute, so then he goes out in the hallway, and then Cecile goes out there, she basically gives him a pep talk, so then he heads out there, he, he yells to get everyone's attention, and then he basically gives one of those like great Joe West speeches and then it just calms everybody down and they're like all right we'll be patient um and then they go back to getting the metahuman cure one at a time and uh Sherlock confronts uh what, the I, I forgot her name but it's her his, his girlfriend uh her about uh, sh her being a metahuman because Cicada goes after her and then she, she Sherlock says that he can uh, d help her get rid of her powers so then they go to get the metahuman cure but then she runs out and then you find out that it's because she doesn't want to take the cure she doesn't want to live in fear like she doesn't want to change herself just because there's danger involved. So then Sherlock decides to send her to another Earth. His Earth, specifically. So she walks through the portal and she goes to his Earth. And then he says that when they defeat Cicada, he'll go find her and they can live happily ever after. So that's great. Um... Oh, and also, Thon is uh, getting ready to be killed uh, because, like, remember he had that timer, like, outside of his cell, and when that timer runs out, they're going to execute him. And that's what, what's about to happen in this episode. But I'll get into that more later, because first I have to talk about the whole cicada thing. Um... Yeah, so the the Team Flash has the mirror gun now, and that can destroy Cicada's dagger. But then they just need to find her. And that is when they find out that Nora is still connected with Grace, so she can see through Grace's eyes. But that causes her to have red lightning again, because... She feels Grace's anger, so that's not good. And obviously Barry and Iris are worried and don't want her to go into the dark side again. But after a while, they end up trusting her. And then they let her do it and find out where Cicada is. And then they fi find out that she's going to CCPD and she has the whole device put together that would kill all the metahumans. And uh, earlier in the episode, when, like, when all the metahumans were gathered at CCPD, I was saying, like, you know, it, this would be so easy for Cicada. She could just show up at CCPD, and there would be a whole bunch of metahumans there that she could just easily kill. And I was right, because that's exactly what she did. Well, she didn't kill them, but she tried. Um, because... She knocked everybody out, like, all Team Flash. Then she started uh, putting her, like, 
she powered on her machine thing that would end up killing uh, all the metahumans, and she had to stick her stick her dagger in it so that it would power it, I think. And then, um, then Team Flash started to uh, fight her, and then Cisco went in there into uh defuse the bomb thing while the rest of team flash tried to hold her off but they weren't enough because then they got in there and uh C cicada knocked out all team flash again she got in there she, uh cisco had just like defused the bomb thing and was about to kill cisco and all of a sudden, Barry comes up behind her and punches her, I think, in the head. So maybe he knocked her out. Um, but then they're able to get the dagger. And then Barry is about to destroy it. But then Ralph realizes something. That things didn't add up. Because Thawne had to, ha had to have had a plan in here. And the whole episode, he was saying that they have to pay attention to what his plan would be. And they're like, no, we have to focus on Cicada. But then he realizes what his plan is. So then he's like, no, don't destroy the dagger. But then Barry shoots the mirror gun and destroys the dagger. Then that is when you see this picture show up on the screen. When they take off Thon's chest plate thing, you see that he has the dagger in his chest. So when they destroy that, that's going to break him out of there, I think. It's a genius plan, and it's pretty cool. Um, so that's pretty much the end of the episode. Cicada is in the next episode. I don't really know why. Uh, I'm excited to see some reverse Flash stuff. Um, yeah. Let me know what you thought down in the comments below when it comes to this episode. Please rem remember to like comment and subscribe and i hope to see you in my next video so i can bestow all my dc knowledge upon you